Hi, it's Deborah from Beacon of Light, and today is Monday, July 29th. Let's see what today's energy is going to be all about. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Hope everybody has a great week ahead. And here's our three cards. We have the Ten of Swords in reverse. We have the Ten of Cups upright. We have the Queen of Wands. This Ten of Swords in reverse, it's a very positive card with it being in reverse. It's almost as if, again, we are reversing some of the uh, conditioning and the, the negative thoughts, the doubts, the things that creep inside of our head. Um, and we're moving into a more flowing state with this Ten of Cups, allowing all of the opportunities, allowing all of the emotions to come in, be experienced, and then released. And this, and both these cards then reduce to a number one, which leads to the Queen of Wands. And the Queen of Wands is that, that inspiration, that passionate energy, the feminine passionate energy that is creative and it it's inspiring and it's exciting and so there's this level of you can do anything that comes your way and kind of I kind of want to go back to a couple of videos prior where I said just do it just get out there and what it is you're thinking about doing just doing and trying and don't don't fear what you don't know or what you think you know there is opportunities here where they're coming in for you to experience and to get excited about. And so this energy of these two tens is pushing us to take those chances, those new beginnings, those new ideas that are coming in and want you to act on them. And now, you know, if anything, just write them down for right now and and see how they play out because this is a, a nice manifestation with this queen of wands where the, the energy is so potent it can it's very creative and it can do anything so today is just kind of one of those days where you you know you're letting go you know you're no longer following um and uh, you're off the old path you're on a new one and this new path is definitely um very um it's, it's self-nurturing, it's self-love, it is, um, it, it's going through all the fields, because you can see they're all here, it's going through all the fields, and it is allowing you to still be in a, a safe and nurturing place to yourself and others, and so trust that, trust that you got yourself under control, trust that that's 10 means that you have mastered a certain level of your emotions. And now it's time to take that and get creative with it. All right, everybody. I hope you have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.